All right, all right, all right. We are back here at Song of the Day, coming to you from the Rock Cave. I'm your host, Mark Pierce. It is Tasty Tunage Tuesday, and we are taking a trip to the beach today because this record, released today in 1979, was a must-have at the beach. You put this cassette in, play it, flip it, play it. Perfect record for a nice day with your friends. We're talking Van Halen, March 23rd, 1979. They released their second record, Van Halen 2. Goes on to sell over 6 million copies, goes to number 6 on the charts. Two singles, we'll talk about those. But let's talk about this record first. I mean, this is an epic record to talk about, and if you don't know it, you know what I'm going to tell you you're going to need to do today. But Van Halen, they're coming off their first album and their first world tour with the likes of Black Sabbath. They are partying like crazy. This is an unexpected hit, and they just go crazy, and they have a great time. And they're, they land back in the United States, and they're supposed to make a second record. I read that they were given a less budget for a second record than the first one. Can't figure that one out. They go back into Sunset Studios less than a year later, and they've got some demos that they recorded from... Uh, those famous Gene Simmons demos. They've got a few of those and some demos from the very first recording. And they put together this record. And many of these were, were one take, as far as we can tell. So uh, this is a pretty darn good record. It's got a little bit of everything on it. You want forward, massive, huge, hard guitars? Yep, check. Monster Guitars on DOA and Somebody Get Me a Doctor, which was one of those demos. You want radio-friendly songs that you can sing along to? Check. You got Dance the Night Away and Beautiful Girls, which are all over the radio. Your Rock Block Weekend on 102 AQY. All summer long, baby. You got Michael Anthony. He's showcasing his singing. He's basically singing backup pretty, uh, you know, he's doing a good job there. He's, he's a backup on Dance the Night Away. You're no good. He's doing his jazz bass on uh, Out of Love Again and Somebody Get Me a Doctor. You got Light Up the Sky, which is the perfect marriage of all four of them, showing off what they all do so well. That's a quintessential Van Halen song where they're all happy. This whole record, you can tell, they're just having a good time. But that one's Light Up the Sky is just, you can tell that they're just, they are in the groove on that one. You got Spanish Fly, which shows off Eddie Van Halen, Rip Eddie. Uh, he's got like a one minute guitar solo in there. So Spanish Fly, very famous. And then you've got you're no good the lead track what an intro to that song i mean this is a great song and i'm going to be honest here i'm embarrassed to say that when i first heard that song and for many many years we're talking a long time it took me a long time to realize that that's the same song just arranged differently that linda ronstadt covered and had her first number one hit it just sounds so different i mean obviously there's no strings but wow that was a that took me a while to come around to that one so i didn't know that uh, Eddie Van Halen, he did want to introduce uh, some synthesizers at this point. That's how early he wanted to do that. The band was like, no, so he wouldn't get his way, as we all know, until 1984. Um, the record itself, remember when we cared about the album cover designs? Many choices. I'll try to post those alternate covers, alternate pictures on the back. Uh, there is a picture of Dave with a cane and a cast. Uh, he's got uh, female nurses on his side. Uh, he did break his foot when they were posing for these uh, pictures for the album. He did his signature kick, and on the third attempt, landed and broke his foot. They did get the picture, as you can see, but that's why he's got that cane with him. Uh, the black and yellow guitar was made during the recording sessions. They didn't actually use it on the record. Uh, I read that uh, Pantera's guitarist, Dimebag, uh, was buried in 2004 with that guitar. Eddie Van Halen gave it to his family because he said it was one of his favorite records. He also had a Kiss casket. If you haven't seen that, that's a thing. Um, Van Halen thanked the Sheridan Hotel in Madison, Wisconsin in their liner notes. Why? Because they destroyed the seventh floor on that world tour. Fire extinguisher fights and throwing TVs out the windows and then blamed it on Journey, who was also on the same tour as them. Uh, there's a lot to like about this record, like I said. 
uh, this is pretty amazing. So, this is pretty amazing. I mean, this is uh, this is up there. And if you don't listen to Van Halen too very often, I think feel like it gets maybe a little bit skipped by. But this is a really, really good record. So your job today is to listen to Van Halen too. Uh, I think it ranks up there. Although they all kind of rank in the middle because it's for me, they kind of interchange. As first and last are the ones that are very clear for me for David Lee Roth era albums. In first place is Fair Warning by far, not even close and it's women and children last for me. In the middle, they're so close I can move them all around. Uh, but this record, You're No Good, Dance the Night Away, Somebody Get Me a Doctor, Bottoms Up, we didn't even talk about that. They're having a great time on that. That's a great song, Bottoms Up. Out of Love Again, uh, Light Up the Sky, like I said, Spanish Fly, DOA, man, that's a good one. Just, uh, that's just a heavy good one. Women in Love, Beautiful Girls, a lot, like lot to like on this record. If you're going to do Song of the Day, I listened to this whole record. It was a tough one for me. We talked about it. I'm going to do You're No Good, the opening track, because what a way to start a record, and what a way to start your day. So, we said it. We'll say it again. This is an awesome Van Halen record. Glad to be talking about it. David Lee Roth, what a guy. There's no one like him in music. David, if you're out there, hit me up. we got a lot to talk about. Come on my show. i got a lot of questions. And uh, have a great day. We're going to wrap it up now. You're no good. Van Halen. As usual, I'll catch you on the flip side.